Hey families! All right, here's our next activity. This can be done either outside, if you're able to go outside into your yard, or on a very safe walk with an adult. Okay, here it is. I'm going to give you a spring scavenger hunt. Woohoo! The first item on our list is find a yellow flower. Huh, where could you find a yellow flower? <gasps> I found one! It's in my hair! What? A yellow flower in my hair? It's like I planned it! Ha! Huh? So crazy! Okay, so take this on with you on a safe walk or even outside. But if you're not able to go outside, that's okay too. I'm going to send you the list, but I'm also going to send you pictures of things from the list. Moms and dads, grandmas and grandpas, even big brothers or sisters. You can take these pictures, cut them up, hide them around the house, and then your child can go look for them and go on a scavenger hunt inside. Better yet, you can cut these up and after your child finds them, they can hide them for you and you can go on the scavenger hunt inside. Oh, that's pretty crazy. Don't feel like you need to use these. Get creative. If you want to draw in color, go for it. If not, you can go on a scavenger hunt on the internet. Hmm, so much fun, but make sure if you want to do this, you send a picture of any of the items that you find to your teacher. I bet they're going to be really excited to see things you found. Happy hunting!